Bonjour, bonjour. Welcome in France at the Paul Ricard, South of France. Beautiful track. Uh, I wouldn't say anything else, would I? And I'm going to take you through a lap and give you some of my um, key places on the racetrack. Let's go. Out of the last corner, onto the main straight, DRS open. Going into turn one and two. Here, eight gear, quite long straight line. Pit exit coming here, so in the race, you've got to watch it. It's not an easy braking, as you can see, it's quite blind on the apex, and there's many, many lines. So, not an easy apex to get, and you need to make sure that you actually stay here to go over the crest here and do that right hand side corner flat out. You don't want to end up on the outside curve, it's a very nasty one. And then here, he, here quite a small break. Use a lot of inside curvy here. Make sure you position well yourself for that corner. Stay on the left as this turn five right inside corner up in. It's key to prepare the whole straight line of the Mistral. So here again, try to stay as, as flat as you can. Uh, exit as wide as you can as long as this turn seven stays flat. Onto the back straight. DRS open. Eight gear. Uh, big, big overtaking opportunity at the end of the straight. Here, big breaking to go into the chicane. A uh, couple of options here. Either you stay a little bit on the left to prepare well the right. But actually, more the weekend goes, more the grip act ends up being here. And you do prepare that corner a little less than you do in free practice. Just because it creeps up. Uh, big bump on exit here. Be careful when you go on throttle. Then on to sink corner. That'll be easy flat in the race. There you go. And then uh, double right of the Bosset. To me, that's one of the most beautiful uh, corner of the whole season. You want to go as wide as you can, stay on the apex, and then stay on the, on the racing line, and then hit the second apex, hit the curve on exit, but that's high speed, and you don't want to have a snap or something like that. That corner here, very, very easy to lock turn 12, very easy to lock the inside uh, wheel, because from the moment you break, you're actually already turning. You can use a lot of curve here on exit, uh, it's quite smooth. And then we're going into turn 14. He has a quick downshift. Uh, a lot of high speed. But then you need to make sure that you stay well on the left to prepare turn 15 here. And get a decent exit as the start finish line here. Um, it's a long straight line. So yeah, beautiful track. Not easy. Uh, quite some high speed corner and some very low speed corner. 